What's up, everybody? Welcome to Fallout 76. Not the 76th Fallout. I'm assuming they're doing a play on uh, 1776. No, the Vault 76. Yeah, yeah, but 1776. Oh, yeah, when that would make sense. When America was, you know, yeah, became America. Did, did the thing. Because, well, I don't want to... Yeah, no, it was discovered 1776, right? No, no dude. No, no, set up 14... 17... Actually, people lived here forever. Yeah, it became America in 1776. Well, I think it was always America. But, like, it became, like, today America. I mean, not really. Today America is, like, crazy different. We have social media. I... I... Yeah, but, like, the Declaration of Independence. Yeah, yeah, was yeah. signed in 1776. Yeah, but, but, again, we have social media now. Yeah. It's much it's different. All different. It's all different. All different. You know, the Constitution would have been written on Twitter now. Yeah, probably. Well, the Declaration of Independence well, maybe a would have Facebook been. post. You can get more characters in there. Yeah. Well, no, because the Declaration of Independence was a saying, like, yeah, now we're fucking free. Imagine if that was just the tweet. Yeah, it was just like, yo, now we're free, bitches. And like, <laughs> it's like, all right. America. I, and Britain's like, ah, oh, shit, they tweeted it. So you must must be real. So dude, how many hashtags they use? Probably a lot. Yeah. yeah, they have to get the word out about yeah. that one. But dude, I'm like really excited this game came out, but I'm not very excited that it came out so close to Red Dead Redemption and the Battlefield and everything else and Pokemon and, and Super and, Smash. Well, like Super Smash, we got like another two couple weeks. weeks. Yeah, but like two that's weeks. Our, that's enough time to like beat Red Dead and like <clears throat> you know like um get into this more and then. Oh, and then the new Hitman Yo, game came out. Yo, what the fuck? These, oh, yeah, fun. this is exactly where I spawned, and I had to run the fuck out of well, here. Well, because in the beta, we were. this is where we were. Yeah, this is exactly where we left off, so when I started... Oh, again, my God, yeah, everybody, get leave the me fuck alone. Out. Well, actually, no, I killed all the farmhand supervisors. Go kill that guy. Okay. You see that guy? Oh, shit. Oh, jeez, puppy. Uh, no, it's, it's a mole rat. <laughs> anyway, but this is uh, Bethesda's new take on the Fallout series. We oh did play the, the beta a bit on stream. And you may need to get the fuck out of here, actually. I'm gonna be fine. Alright, but, uh... I'm don't forget to fine. hit right on the D-pad. Uh... Boy, this Dude, is these mole rats are up my ass! Yo, alright, what I am noticing, though, it is a bit more laggy than the beta. I didn't encounter that problem. A little laggy. Maybe for you. I didn't have that. I mean, just like a little clippy. Is it? It is a little clippy. I don't think so. A little bit. I'm not noticing. I'm feeling it in the controls. Alright, whatever you say. But, uh... So this is Bethesda's take on an open-world shooter MMO type, uh... Um, shared world. Sure, shared world. Yeah, you get really uptight about the... Because MMO is so thing. much different. It's so much different. It's massively different, because it's a massively multiplayer online game. Yeah, instead of, like... 26 mob, people. Like, there's, like... Fucking what? What do you get in like is like a like a like a server? Thousands, tens of thousands. Yeah, but in a world that's like boring, could, it's a boring it's world. It's not. You're world. you're a crazy person. I'll tell They're you why. So boring because there could be a hundred people in a city where in, in this there's what? Yeah, but a hundred people that I don't give a flying fuck about. Maybe you, but I ran the server back in the day. What do you mean? Like, like, like in this, like each individual, per individual person you run into could be a, a potential problem. Any horde you could run into in WoW could have been a potential problem. Or they could have just said Keck. Wasn't there like PvP zones, specific zones you had to go to to fight people? Uh, not in a PvP server, because you could raid Alliance cities. I think this is just a different type of MMO. No, like, I think it's not massive. It's 26 people. You can't say that. 26 people could absolutely be massive. No. Like, look at, now there's three people there. If they see you, what's gonna happen? They could either be cool with you, or they could just fucking shoot you up, and then you're dead. Nah. And then, well, actually, one Why of them's... Why shimmying, bro? One of them's not the, uh, the right level to fight you. I you think, have to be five, right? Yeah. But, uh... I did see a lot of bullshit. People, like, saying, oh, this game is so lame, because, you know, I walked out of the, the vault and got... Killed six times in a like row. That can't happen. It can't happen because you have happen. to be level five. Yeah, yeah, no. Where are these are supervisors? They're the little points. They're little points on the map. Um, yeah, no. Now you have to change the targeting parameters. Remember? Oh, that's right. Yeah. I was just at that building. This is one of those radiant quests that's like just going on. And there's they're all over the place, which yeah. is awesome. Yeah, no, they're literally all over the place. Like last night, I was wandering. And then I found this little like a Mr. Farmhand bot or uh, the Mr. No, it was Mr. Handy that um. That 
needed to <laughs> Mr. be. Mr. Handy? Yeah, Mr. Handy. You know, the little robots with the, 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 the look like octopuses. Yeah. But, uh... See? Yeah. But, so, I, I, ra- I ran across this guy, and he was like, I have, like, a little mission to complete. Can you, uh... I, re- I have a task complete. Can you uh, get me to my, my place? And I was like, yeah, bro, I got you. And then uh, I took him to this place, and it turns out he goes up to, like, this dilapidated house, starts telling them their phone bill. And but like I have to fight like a million things along the way, right? Uh-huh. And then he gets there, tells him phone bill, and then he thanks me and gives me a bunch of stuff. And it was just like a quest, the radiant quest that was going on out there. That's so cool. And I thought that was pretty neat. And then this is like the, like the to best explain like the radiant quest, the events here is like the uh, public events in Destiny. You know what yes. I mean? That's exactly what they are. Where it's a, a public event, anybody can help you do this anywhere in the world. You know, like. These quests are, are going on all over the place. Oh, I'm out of ammo. How do I switch guns? Uh, hit R1, first of all. Oh, I'm screwed. Hit R1. No. No, Mac, you can't pause this. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're playing. <laughs> hit R1. All right. Bash it. All right. Bash it. Like, ba- oh, my oh, God. Oh, I got to get out of here. Mac, all right. What are you doing? We're going to do a little redo, okay? Oh, man. We're just going to take a second, figure things Why out. Why was it so hard for you to hit R1 to bash I it? I panicked. I panicked. <laughs> I panicked. You just you literally I had paused. no health. You I just, paused. I paused and you can't game. pause this yeah. game. That was because a, it's a rookie online. mistake. <laughs> it's rookie it's mistake. Online. And so how do you switch guns? You hit circle and go into your inventory or you favorite a bunch and then hit left on the D-pad or up on the D-pad. Left on the D-pad. Up on the D-pad. Up on the D-pad. Yeah. Okay. Well, up on the D-pad goes to your favorites and then you can pick from your favorites. Yeah, because that was not smooth. And there were a lot, I just have to say, there were a lot of fucking enemies in there. Yeah, they go down pretty quick, but, like, you know, you have to use weapons or fight or do anything. <laughs> do something. You just not just, just cower in a corner. <laughs> I did. I did just yeah. hide up. I yeah. backed up right into that fucking corner. Yeah, yeah. And then hit the pause button. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my hunting rifle broke. Uh, hit circle and then go to items. R2. As you can see, the pit boy looks exactly like the pit boy always does. And you do this. That's okay, cool. first click X on one of those grenades, because grenades just hotkey to R1. Oh, jeez. Okay. You can lob grenades at them. <laughs> Didn't do it. You gotta figure yourself out, man. Look, I'm... Dude, you're R1. dying. You're gonna die. I'm gonna die. You're gonna die. Hit right on the... Uh, oh grenade, my God. very the close. Danger close. Dude, you're bad at this game. <laughs> I'm terrible. You're very bad at this. They're all over the place. Matt, get the fuck out of there and figure out your weapon situation. <laughs> okay. You make a good point, Giggs. Dude, I just have you're no... thirsty. I have you're, no stamina. Oh, my God. You're fucked. Dude. Jumping isn't helping. It's no, wasting stamina. It's not. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. This is crazy how bad you are at this. Okay. Dude, you're not far <laughs> enough. Fine. Equip the a melee weapon, first of all. A hotkey... Uh, oh. Dude. Oh, man. You picked the worst weapon you could have possibly picked, too. You would have yeah. been better with the axe. <laughs> Probably. Jesus. Okay. Let's, uh, let's figure this out. All right. All right. So you already have one favorited. Yes. Okay, your hunting rifle's broken. You got Tom. Equip the tomahawks to R1. Okay. Click X on them. Just click X. Because the, those, the grenades got me to a little the, trouble. The tomahawks are dirty as fuck. It's hysterical tomahawking robots. Okay. Like, ah, tomahawk. I don't have many guns. No, you should probably... Oh, your 10mm pistol is broken as well. Yes. Or is that the one I gave you that you can't use yet because you're not a high enough level? Probably that. So I know I did give you a 10mm pistol you at did. some point. I have a bunch of them. I have a bunch of stuff to just hand you when, uh, when the time I comes. I need a drink. Yeah, yeah, that's... <laughs> Go to aid. Yeah, because in this game you do need to eat and drink or suffer AP reduction. AP being the stuff that like you sprint, jump, and use the VAT system with. Yeah, that's not good. Oh my god. This place sucks. This place sucks. They're all level 1, too. It's just annoying. Well, yeah, it's it's the Radiant Quest area. Those things are going to keep spawning until you finish the fucking thing. Oh, really? I think people finished it, though. Really? Yeah. Or a time ran out on it. Well, I had 26 minutes. Did you? Uh, unless another team went in there and... Yeah, no, it's over. Oh, yeah, look, they, look. they did it. Thank you. They killed everything in here, too. Thank you. Wow. Fuck. See, I've never, like, had help on these Radiant Quests. Every time I run into one of these Radiant Quests, fucking, uh, uh, no one's around and I end up doing it by myself. And they're not, like, terribly hard to do by yourself, but, like, you know. It's, it is a challenge. It's, uh, it's, it's, it, yeah, because there's so many enemies at once. That's the thing. So if you have a whole group there, it's, it's much easier. But, uh. The loading yeah. screens are a bit long, too. Yeah, and the, the, 
people were right. The the lack of like NPCs out there is like kind of weird. It's just eerie. Like there's like I think it's supposed to be though, because you are like the first group of people, well, no, aren't the, you? No, because you you learn in the lore that there were other a ton of other people out here. But I thought set Vault seventy six was like the one of the well, first. I to think open. they changed the lore. Uh, Cause they well they had said they didn't want to be tied down to something someone wrote twenty years ago. All right. So like, but like as you go through the game, you you like learn about these survivors that were out here after the bombs fell and stuff like that, and they're all dead. And you're like, like why the fuck are they all dead? Like like what, like not one of them made it. Like, yeah, and there's no weird. human NPCs out here, and that's like a bizarre thing. But I do love the whole like West Virginia world. And no, it's an interesting thing. I was share playing with Bad last night. Yeah. He could hear everything in the game. Everything. Everything. The holodecks. Everything. He can't hear the radio. They turned it off for copyright purposes. Okay. Yeah. That's just kind because of funny. So when you stream from the PlayStation, people won't be able to hear the radio. How weird. Like, like it's it's so bizarre. He can hear everything in the game, but the minute a song comes on the radio, he, he, can, he can still hear everything going on in the game, but not the song. I'm like, oh, that's, like, one of the biggest allures of this game is, like... Yeah, because there really is... I never not have the radio. No, it, it's it's the best. Yeah, like, having, like, the little, uh... Like, if you have the radio on now, people can hear Whoa. it in the Elgato, but uh, they can't block it through that. Yeah, because we're fucking... Let's do that. Oh, you have two level ups too, by the way. Oh, I have radio on. Cool. What's happening? Oh, uh, now you're being shot again. By what? Oh, oh, stupid nope. mole rats. Okay, go level up. Show people how level up works. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Pit boy, there you go. You have two levels up. Triangle. Triangle. Triangle, man. You are so bad at this. Okay, so the way. Perk per pack. So you get cards that act as perks in this, right? And you equip them to your various skills, and as you level up, you can equip more. Now, what do you do with the bubblegum? You just read it because it's it's pretty funny. Is it? Ah, uh, <laughs> these fucking guys. Uh, in fact, me and Bad saw fucked up one last night when I leveled up. Where it's like, if you, how do you stop your cat from drowning? How? Pull the sack out of the river. Oh, geez. it said that. That's it said that. Cup. It was on the fucking cup. What do you think I should get? <laughs> uh, I went with strength to increase my carrying capacity. Smart. <clears throat> But you don't go with whatever the fuck you feel like. Um, but, so, as you level up, you get these perk cards, and you can, the, the, the higher you level up, the more you can equip to a, a skill, and the more you get of the same card, you can level it up. Oh, and really? Bring it, bring it to the next level, and each level does, increases, like, the, the, what it does for you. And so, people thought, when they saw these, that these were going to be a microtransaction. You can't. You have to level up to get them. It's the only way to get them. Nice. You, the only things you can microtransaction in this game are cosmetic shit. Beautiful. Yeah. Fine. Good. Yeah, yeah. Because it would have been game breaking if you could buy perks from. Well, yeah, because it's it's all about a game that you have to level up for. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. And so, uh, you know, uh, oh, that's dead cow. It's one dead cow. You're also almost over encumbered. But uh, oh yeah, this place has a duffel bag in it. I think that has a bunch of bullets. You okay? Uh, oh wait, no, that's the the reverend dude. That's right. Really interesting story on the computer. Basically, a reverend that thought when the bright light was flashing and the apocalypse was coming that uh, you know it was the rapture and he was going to be taken away. But then he wasn't taken away, so he had to find a mission in life, and so he was helping survivors that were left over after the bombs fell. But then everything was going wrong, and he was quite questioning his commitment to God. It was a crazy story. And I love the like, personal stories yeah, of each of the people you just, find. In just, and then, like, it's just a whole log of community. So it's still Fallout. All these stories are still here, you know, and uh, you're not going to be able to get it. And, and, and uh, like, the, the little Fallout stories are all here. Like, the world's there. Like, the wacky places you find in the world are still there. Just all And then you can come, here. yeah, and then you can just come across a person. Yeah, and so, uh, but, uh, hit down on the D-pad, and then all your emotes are there. Neat. <laughs> but um I should probably go through the bridge. Oof. Nah, cuz not all the, the water is toxic in this. But uh yeah, so that's Fallout 76 in a nutshell. I mean I was going to say in a nutshell. Oh. Well. I was just it was get out of my head. All right, whatever. But you know, that was that was briefly like, it's a good game uh not for everybody. No way. Definitely watch some more video clips of it if you can before you commit to it if you're still like on the fence about it 
But uh, thank you, everybody, for stopping by. We really appreciate it. Please don't forget to click that subscribe button if you enjoyed what you saw. More importantly, everybody, don't forget to check out GigamaxGames.com for all the latest gaming news and industry updates. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Thanks for stopping by.